It's Nicola here from Officiums. Um, this is a very quick uh, just tech tip video that I wanted to do on my phone because um, I've had a request from a lot of my clients about because they're posting a lot from home for the first time because maybe they are uh, without their staff member that does it or they're not in a financial position to have someone do this for them uh, for their business because of obviously what's going on around the world. They've been asking for some sort of um, insight, for want of a better term, and tips and tricks on how to do things a bit more efficiently on, on Facebook and just on in the communication realm. So this is something I thought of. It's a very cool feature. Uh, some, some of you guys may know about it, others may not, and therefore may have learned something new, which will be cool. So basically it's a couple of features that come with the using the space bar when you're typing. So let's just say we're going to type a post and you're on your phone. And we go, hello everyone, and you hit the space bar twice, twice, excuse me, and it automatically puts in a full stop and capitalise the next letter. So it's a very cool feature, um, rather than having to um, go down to the sub menu, put in a full stop, and carry on. So it literally shaves off a couple of seconds. No biggie, but. Um, we're all wanting to save some time and in that particularly in our work environment so uh, so again just to keep typing and show you um, wanted want to make sure all is okay double space okay and as you can see we've got a typo there and that's um quite normal when we're all uh, typing on our phones what's well, normal for me so another cool feature is rather than um tap on your screen to try and get to the location that you want edit particularly when it's in the middle of a word like that you know in the in the so what you can do is hold the space bar down and you can see on the screen that the keypad grays out and you can actually just maneuver the cursor to where you want to edit and drop it and then just backspace and make your edit. It's just a lot more better maneuverability in regards to tapping on the screen and not getting exactly where you want to go, particularly if it's in the middle of the word. Like everyone is a, is a fantastic example. So if we basically just wanted to tap on that or part of it, you know, I wanted to take out, um, you know, just edit that in case there was a mistake. And you see, you can't. But with the holding the space, you can actually manoeuvre to where you want to be and change that word to whatever you want it to be. So that's quite a cool feature as far as the editing goes. And this works, obviously, in your posts and it works in your text messages. So hopefully that's been helpful, guys. And maybe um, someone's learned something new, which is cool. So keep an eye out, I'm going to be doing regular little shortcuts and tips and tricks and this doesn't necessarily have to be about Facebook, it can be anything that I offer within Officium, so anything to do with the office, um, you want to find out how to manipulate something in Word or Excel or you're just, something's doing your head in and you don't want to go on YouTube to figure it out, I'll happily do a video for you, so just shoot me a message, leave a comment on this post um, or hop onto my website and send me a message. Uh, I'll happily do something for you, um, no problems at all. Okay guys, take care, until next time. Thanks.